In 1939, the world caught on fire. Well, the signs had been there for years, but when Hitler crossed the border into Poland, the balloon really went up. One country after another went down under the Blitzkrieg, while back home, we just watched and waited and tried to tell ourselves it was none of our business. At least, some of us did. There were a few who didn't want to sit back and wait for Hitler to come knocking on our doors. Some of us who were pilots found a way to join up with the RAF, to help out any way we could. They called us Eagle Squadrons, and I was with the 71st, the very first one formed. Officially, our first action was the Battle of Britain, but that's not quite true. The first time I fired my plane's weapons in anger was at Kinloss, OTU, where I'd been sent to rendezvous with another American recruit for training. His name was Joe Castle, and he was from Mississippi. He'd never been away from home before. Howdy, Captain. Now that you're squared away, I'll be going up with you to get you acquainted with what you'll be flying. You're Joe, right? I thought you were a mechanic. Well, yeah, mainly, but uh, I do a little piloting, too. That's the only way they take me, you know? But enough yapping, let's get this kite in the air. We gotta take off sooner or later. Try flying a little. Like this? That's it, Captain. You're doing just fine. Cut her loose, Captain. She ain't fragile. Uh, it's nice to see another American over here, let me tell you. Uh, the folks here are great, but they can use all the help they can get. There you go. Take a look around. 
beautiful, ain't it? From up here, the airfield looks like a dollhouse. Now, over there is the village. Bring her in low if you want to see how many of them are light sleepers. <laughs> That's a hell of a way to make an introduction. Take a look around. Beautiful, ain't it? From up here, the airfield looks like a dollhouse. Now, over there is the village. Bring her in low if you want to see how many of them are light sleepers. <laughs> That's a hell of a way to make an introduction. Well, better us than the Germans. So, I was in the local with a couple of the other pilots, and they were talking about how they can bring their planes around while keeping an eye on the other guy. You want to learn how to do that? What you're waiting for? The camera ain't gonna work itself. Good. Now just fly over the church while keeping your eyes on it. They got an army base over yonder, too. Beats the heck out of the forts I used to make when I was a kid. Great maneuver. I see you got it. Keep practicing. This will help you a lot during air combat. Good. Now just fly toward the military base. Good. Let's head to the airport now. at the military base. Okay, they're gonna be replacing the barrage balloons over there anyway, so we can test out the guns on the old girl and have a little fun while we're at it. There's a target now. You see it? Why don't we go give that balloon what for? That's one balloon that won't be bothering us again. You got another target off to the right. And there's one over to the left. on this one. Don't forget about that one. That one less. Now let's make like we're strafing a German convoy. Pretend those balloons are trucks and take them out. off the throttle a bit to slow down and see if that don't help your aim none. Thanks for the tip. Now try speeding up. You're gonna need to be able to shoot fast and accurate up here. Got it. <laughs> 